Hi, I'm Rich Blumenthal with the Ferrocycle Company, and we have a brief video here to share with you regarding your introduction to the Ferrocycle. The focus of this video is going to be on your fitting to the Ferrocycle so that you can have a positive riding experience. The Ferrocycle's motor is located here on the front of the unit, and it connects to the internal gearbox. The gearbox is what enables the rider to set the speed of the bike anywhere between 1 and 15 miles per hour. This display face here is where the rider would set that speed and the length of time that they want to ride for. These handlebars can move down or up and then be set to accommodate the rider's specific fit. The Ferrocycle has two different seat knobs. One seat knob is down here behind the bike and this allows the rider to move up or down. And then there is a second seat knob here that allows the seat to move forward or backward. In addition to that, on the pedal arm, there is an adjustment that you can make so you can have a larger or smaller rotation. The Ferrocycle has a step-through design to make it easy to get on and off. Step through with your strong side. Then once you're seated, you can use these handlebars on the side of the seat to brace yourself against the seat back and shimmy your feet into the pedal and the stirrup so that they fit snugly. To determine the fit for a new Ferrocycle rider, you want to have the foot that is furthest away from you have a slight bend like this and the leg that's on that side. On the other side, for the leg that's closer to you, you want to have this 90 degree angle approximately so that the hip and knee aren't coming much higher than that as you're cycling and not causing any discomfort to the rider. To position the handlebar for new TheraCycle riders and incorporate some upper extremity movement, that's going to work not just the arms, but the shoulders, the back, and the torso. You want this handlebar to be level, approximately level, with the sternum. Not so high that it's going to be here and you're going to be reaching. Not so low that it's going to come into the tops of your knees while you're cycling. But somewhere in this range where you're mimicking a push-up motion as it goes away from you, and a rowing motion as it comes back to you. I'm going to put the safety magnet onto the front of my shirt here. And then I'm going to hold on to these handlebars on the side of the seat initially when I start the bike. When I hit start, the Therocycle is going to count down from 5 all the way down to 1 and then begin. When the Therocycle starts, we suggest holding on to these handlebars on the side initially just to get comfortable with the motor and see how that feels. After you've ridden for a while and you feel how the motor works and how it provides assistance, you can gently grab onto these handlebars and move back and forth like a roller coaster. We suggest just grabbing on with your fingertips initially so you can feel how this back and forth rowing motion works for you. Once you're comfortable with it, you can get more of a firm grip and get into some pulling and pushing with this handlebar to incorporate some upper body work. Once you're comfortable with that motion, you can move on to setting the speed and increasing the speed to something that's comfortable for you and it's going to push you at a pace that's a little bit more brisk than what you might normally be used to. Once you have a comfortable fit and speed setting on the TheraCycle, you can start to use this handlebar to incorporate some strength work into your riding sessions. As the handlebar goes away from you, you can lean into it and push against it. That'll mimic a push-up or bench press type of motion. And then you can also turn your palms up towards the ceiling and pull towards you to mimic a bicep curl or a rowing motion. The TheraCycle 300 includes the swivel seat mechanism. This enables a rider to come up, back into the seat, put on the seat belt, and then hit this latch on the left side of the seat and pivot until they're facing forward and the latch locks into place. This video is intended to provide guidance in helping you with your individual fitting on the TheraCycle. And if you have other questions, please contact us. We hope that this helps you to live better and enjoy the ride.